In this video, I'm going to be reviewing a software called Brainwork. Brainwork is an AI SEO copywriting assistant that helps you generate SEO friendly rankable content in just a few clicks. Whilst I typically use the 80-20 rule when using these sort of tools, it seems Brainwork has done a really interesting job of creating blogs from scratch. In other words, you don't need to do that much. Now, if you have any questions about Brainwork, go ahead and drop them in the comments below. I tend to reply within a couple of minutes to a couple of hours, and I'll also leave a special discounted link that I'll keep updated so you constantly get your money's worth for Brainwork. Let's head over to Brainwork's dashboard and let me show you how to use it. One last thing, if you've been looking for a mentor to earn a side income on YouTube, why not enroll in my course, which will teach you how I earn four to five figures every single month, ultimately passively on YouTube. And this course is backed with a live case study. It's an over the shoulder case study, which shows you all the products that I actually earn money from and creating a brand new YouTube account from scratch and you can watch it grow and real-time earnings. I'll go ahead and leave a link in the description below. Now, let's head over to Brainwork. Here we are in the dashboard of Brainwork and like always, it's a nice, simple, flat dashboard. You have your shortcuts to each individual feature Brainwork offers and on the left you have your main navigation. Also they've got the live chat feature right here and under the what's new tab you can see how much development they've been doing every single day and their road work and what's been going on. Now instead of going through each one of these tools and making this video 10 times longer I'm gonna really address the AI writing assistant tool because this one tool has all of these components in it. Realistically this is the tool that you're gonna always want to use and you're going to find out why. I would recommend starting off by clicking the project tab, manage projects and then create a new project. Title it anything you want, add a URL and then do save. We now have a folder that we can start categorizing things. When you click on it, it brings you to the dashboard. Go ahead and click new post under the AI copywriting tool and now you want to enter your main keyword. So this blog post is going to be about how to train a dog to sit. So how to train a dog to sit and then do continue. And it's telling you the chances of whether or not Brainwork is going to generate a good or poor quality blog for you. In this instance, it's saying it's a good chance it's going to be a really good quality blog. Once you press continue, it brings you to a suggested keyword screen where it gives recommendation of keywords so it can create better content for your blog. Additionally, you can add your own keywords, but these look pretty good. So how do you train a dog set? how to train a dog to sit and stay, and dog training tip, as well as dog commands. Go ahead and click create. Before we start writing, let's go over our playground area. On the left, you have your sidebar, which shows the assistant. That controls the actual assistant on the right. Then you've got the preview, save, plagiarism, publish, share, download, tutorials. Under the tutorial section, you've got step-by-step -step video training, each one around about five to 15 minutes. Then you've got your delete and exit. On the top, you've got your traditional styling elements, such as heading tags, image insertion, listicles, uh, alignment, bolding, and highlighting, linking, etc. And underneath it, you've got the, the brainwork add-ons, such as paragraph generator, listicle generator, step-by-step -step generator, rephrase, and summarizer. Here is where you enter the actual text. Pencil icon is expanding sentences. On the right you have your main assistant which is where we're going to do the bulk sum of the work. Now that we've cleared that up let me show you how this works. So we've already told Brainwork what we want to write about so now under titles let's start off by doing generate. Now it generates all the different sorts of headings that we can use. I'm going to go ahead and do how to train a dog to sit the base. Now we have our title we move over to outline. Go ahead and click generate and now it's generated an introduction, the general outline and a conclusion. Let's go ahead and add that in. Moving on to SEO it's giving us an SEO score which is updated in real time and it tells us where we can do better or where we worse. Another nifty feature is the featured image area and when you click on this it's got a built-in live from Unsplash which is roll to free images. We can go ahead and select an image and then do done. Now that's been updated and you can amend the alt text. Under keywords it shows you your primary keyword, related keywords, uh, keywords we've already got in and then questions which we may not have thought of. You just click the plus icon to add it into the document. So now that we've got the initial bulk sum of the blog done all we need to do is expand each one of these areas. So I'm just going to highlight this section 
and then click paragraph. It's generated a paragraph for me. Then I can repeat the process for each one. And in a matter of seconds, we've already got 486 words. Next, we want to clean them up by highlighting and then clicking the heading tab. I'm going to do this for the rest of them. Now, once you've tweaked it, you can continue editing it. So next, I'm going to use the expand sentence. So I'm going to place my mouse here, do a space and then click the icon. Now it's expanded. If you're not happy with it, highlight it and then do rephrase. And there you go. You can highlight words, add a URL and then do save. And then ultimately, this is how you would build a blog. Let's have a look at the preview. This is how it will look online. And you'll also have the choice to download it in HTML, PDF, document and tech. Let's have a look at what it looks like in a PDF. And this is how it will look like in a PDF. If you want to carry on editing it, click the edit button. And let's have a look at what it looks like in plagiarism checker. It's found no plagiarism. If you want to publish this straight to a website, go ahead and click publish under platform, select your website and then do publish. You can share this by making this public and now you've got a unique URL. So if you click on that, it takes people to a URL. When you've finished editing them, all the articles will be found in the feature tab that you were using. Although this Brainwork review was short, you saw the power of all the tools that Brainwork have to offer. And honestly, I'm pretty blown away. I've reviewed tons of AI writing assistants and honestly, this one kind of hits the nail on the head. It's smooth to use, it's not glitchy, everything works as it should, and the quality of the writing is not too bad. Now, like most AI writing tools, you still need to give it a human touch. So I would still recommend applying the 80-20 rule where 80% of the work is done by the tool and then 20% is done by you tweaking it, fact checking and making sure it all reads smoothly. Overall, I would actually recommend this tool to my friends and I definitely think all the other AI copywriting tools on the market have a serious competitor. I look forward to seeing the progress of brain work. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.